So hey, extraordinary peeps. Yeah, it's extraordinary if you know who this this girl is. So yeah. So I know you're probably like, whoa, your hair looks so different. Yeah, because it's doing a treatment to it right now. Like this is like my natural hair, but I've been battling with frizz. That's why my hair looks so frizzy. But that's not what this video is. It is what's in my backpack, so Let's hop into this vid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So first thing I think I should show you is my backpack. Um, I got it from Target. And yeah. And it is from Maziama. It looks like this. And it's I just think of Army so much when I see this backpack. It's kind of weird. So first things first, let's open up the first pocket. My bleh, bleh. Got so got sleeve. Excuse me. Okay, so this is my puzzle pouch. And um, it just has like little things on it. It has like lipstick, black mas mascara, glitter, gloss, cat eyes, smoky eye, um, thick eyeliner, something like that. And so inside of my pencil pouch, I just have like colorful pins. A stapler, scissors, glue, whiteout, post-its, yeah, grippies, and highlighters, colored pencils. I feel like I need to show you one of everything, or at least one, and pencils. So, yeah. Um... Yeah, so if you check out my um, school supply video, you'll see everything that's in my pencil pouch. Because I literally bought everything. The only thing that's new is a glue stick and scissors, and yeah, I believe that's the only thing new. And a pencil pouch and a book bag, so besides that, I'm good. So in this pencil pouch, oh, and BT dubs, I start school tomorrow, which is August the 26th, so this video probably won't be up by then, but it may, so yeah. Um, yeah, in that pocket I have two dollars because I don't know what the day is going to be like. I don't know what I'm going to need. So I'm just going to bring money because you never know. Then I have binder clips. You guys probably already know what those look like. Those are my extra binder clips. And these are my extra pens and pencils. They just look like this. They are just like that. So I have a pink and purple one and a purple and orange pencil. Eh. Next thing I have is in this pencil pouch. I mean, in that pouch. First thing I have, and the last thing I have is this Chevron index card box. And it just is rainbowed. It probably looks like there's like these big gaps, but those are white lines. So, yeah. I would go in depth of that, but if you check out my school supplies, you'll probably see an in depth of that. Anyway. So, yeah. The first thing uh, is this next but before I do that I am just going to show you guys what's in the back of my book bag because you know who doesn't like the back of a book bag and I am trying to talk my way around showing you guys that because I am trying to put the stuff back in the pocket so yeah <laughs> next the, the first thing I have um, in the back of my book bag and the last thing I have is the tag and this um it's from Purell. I lose these like so often or I lose the hand sanitizer on it. So I'm not going to pay $5 for that at Bath and Body Works when I can get it from like Target or Walmart for a dollar. And I got this for $1.25 and it, well, oh, now I know how hand sanitizer tastes. Yeah, it smells like Clorox or something. As I was saying, um... The next part is in, wait, oh, the next thing are my keys, and since I am going to the ninth grade, I need uh, a key because we get out, like, really early, and nobody is, like, at home, and then I have my YMCA card, another keychain, a teddy bear, and another keychain, so, basically, that's all. Did you? Okay, so, next thing is in the flap. I have to 
untangle this because this is really complicated and unnecessary. But um, yeah, then I have this. Then I do this. This is like a lot, you know, just to get in the book bag. So I'm gonna start off with this. Are my binders? And you guys already probably know what this is because of my um, back to school video. It's just a pink one, orange one, green one, and a blue one. So, yeah. And I'll have folders and notebooks and paper in it. That's kind of obvious, but, you know, some people just don't know that. And then next thing I have in here is a composition notebook. And it just has vintage flowers on it with hearts around it, and it's Bradley Burns Studio C. And it's really flexible, and as you can tell, I'm really in the flexible this year. Okay, and then I have paper that I've already opened. And yeah, so I'm just going to use this if I need it. And next is copy paper. And last, but potentially not least, is my schedule. So I'm going to show you to you guys. I know people are like, really? Who would honestly want to care where you live? I mean, most of you guys would really wouldn't care. But, you know, you never know who's watching these videos. So, yeah. So, first thing I'm going to show you is, like, what grade I am in, basically. Uh, grade 9. And so, yeah, I don't even know if I'm in high school. That's pretty much it. So, so for first block, I have health and PE. Second block, I have um, contemporary law and justice. Third, um, third block, I have algebra one. Fourth block, I have honors world history. Yeah, that's what my cousin meant. Okay, so I have a cousin who's older than me. And he already knows that something is wrong with the schedule. But, yeah, I have three fourth blocks. So, obviously, something is wrong with it. But, yeah, then I have Honors English 1 and Fetches Merchandising at Home Room. And I don't have, like, Honors English 1 yet or um, World History. I signed up for those classes, like, Honors World History and, like, Honors English 1. But they, like, something went wrong with the schedules and everything is, like, really messed up. But, yeah, I'm going to continue anyways. And then I have fashion merchandising, and then I have homeroom, because I am going to be in gym, I have to kind of report somewhere. So, yeah, it's homeroom, and yeah, and like, we have these different buildings in our school, because like, they're detached, like I'm in like, building 900, 200s, 400s, 800s, 700s, 400s, 700s, like 200s, like I'm just going to be all over the school, as you can tell, so I'm probably not going to get a locker. Because, like, from 900 to 200, that's probably going to be a walk. So, I'm probably going to have a hustle. And, you know, you know me. If you don't, then, um, you know me. So, yeah, I basically just showed you guys my schedule. And that's best way. I think it's something in my pocket. <laughs> These little things. But, yeah, that is basically it. Because I am going to the ninth grade, you probably don't really think I have a lot because my school really doesn't give you school supplies list. But I still do think that I have a generous amount of things like index cards box, money, extra pencils, a pencil pouch full with a whole bunch of things. I mean, four binders, um, copies of notebooks, paper, copy paper, my schedule, and yeah. So I think I have enough. I mean, if I need more... I'll get more, but I don't think I need more. So, yeah. So, I hope you guys uh, really found some inspiration of what you should carry in your book bag for this. And if you have started school already, I'm sorry if you don't like it. But, yeah. Um, and also, uh, tell me anything in the comments. Anything. But, yeah. Um, so, I hope you guys have an amazing first school year. And I'm sorry to inform you guys, but this is my last back to school video. And I hope you guys have an amazing full school year. So, XO to you guys. <gasps> I am just loving my hair. That's why I'm touching it so much. <gasps> Anywho, have an amazing full school year. And.